Hey everybody, um, it's Jen here again. I know that I have not been the greatest on this thing. I know I've taken like a two year, maybe a year and a half hiatus. Um, so, um, so I've been working really, really hard to, I don't know, just working really hard. Anyway, so I wanted to get back into the food review thing. Um, I can't really back to the food review thing. I found a new, like, almost like it's a frozen meal, but it's like a somewhat healthy frozen meal, I guess you'd call it. I'm not even sure if it's that. Well, anyway, it's called Taipei. And what it is is just, like, Chinese food in a container, throw out the microwave for like five minutes, and it's not like, if you look in the back now, um, it's actually cooking, uh, which is, because I'm sorry, that's why I wanted to do the food review, I forgot I had it in the freezer, anyway, so, I didn't even know about this item, and I, some of you know, some of you don't, I work in a grocery store, so I would see all the new items that come in, you know, that's what I deal with, well, I had no idea about it, and the guys that I work with had didn't tell me. So I had a customer come up to me who I'm really close with and he's like, have you tried these new Taipei, you know, dinners? And I'm like, what the hell are you talking about? He's like, they're really, really good. They're really good. I'm like, all right, well, if you're saying it, it's gotta be good. You don't ever like, you know, um, worry about anything. You never read about anything. So I was like, okay. So let me check it out. So I got the I think it was a chicken chow mein. I believe that's the one I got right now. And, uh, put a little bit of soy sauce in that, cooked it up, mixed it. It has, like, all the ingredients and all that in there. It is really good. Like, for a frozen meal, for, like, one person, it is really good. And on the go, it's great because I set up a, I have a second job now, so between running through for the grocery store and then going and doing my second job which is a bar back work at a bar um I'm constantly like, like it's either one or the other one if, if I'm here this is like my day off I actually had nothing to do well, I have plenty to do but I'm not gonna do it probably so I just wanna relax uh, so a long weekend coming up I have Maritime Festival which is you know the closest street down and it's open vendors and lots of liquor lots of everything so, anyway, so I figured I'd do a quick review on this while it's cooking. Um, I think it's a fairly new company. I, you know, I've never really heard of it before until like last week. Um, just ignore my guys in the back. They're, uh, bath time. Uh, so yeah, let's see if it cooks and see what happens when it's done. I got like 36 seconds on it, so I guess I'll wait and I'll pull, I'll uh, show you guys the finished product. It's, it's all blurry now. Hold on. There we go. I don't like when it's blurry. It drives me nuts. Um, so yeah, I'm starting to get back into this whole vlogging, YouTubing thing. I been meaning to do it, but I said, like I said, I had a second job, and things, how life happened, so I just didn't, um, anyway, so, let me get that for you guys, see, now it's ready, alright guys, I'm back, so, like I said, about, it took about a couple minutes, about four minutes, about when I put it in, so, it's really hard right now, so this is what it is, Taipei chicken chow mein. Um, as you can tell, it's really fucking hot. It's got noodles. Oh shit. Let me see if I can do this. It's got noodles and all kinds of crazy things in there, like broccoli and your, you know, normal. It's got the noodles, whatnot. And, um, instead of let it sit for about two minutes, so that's what I'm gonna do. 
And like I said, these are really quick, easy, on-the-go meals. Um, I'm never home. Like, uh, you know, I sit on the couch for 20 minutes and sits, you know, if that. If I've seen the news in the past year, I probably haven't. And of course, because there's there's flavor to it, but with Chinese food, without you know soy sauce. And you're probably thinking, "Oh my God, this stuff is so bad for you." It's the only thing that keeps my body going. It's salty, but. I drink about 12 of these a day. Let's give this a taste test. It's good. I mean, I'm not gonna lie. The chicken, it's not like you would, you know, make it fresh, stir fry, or whatever yourself. But it's frozen chicken. It's about as good as you're gonna get. Okay. Focus on me. Yeah, there you go. What is this? That? Carrots, all kinds of stuff in it. This is one of my favorite meals. Um, to go meals. They've got. Chicken chow mein, chicken lo mein, general sauce chicken, chicken and rice, uh, sweet and sour chicken, which is really good. Those are the four right now. Um, looking into getting more of them in the section too, but that comes later on because, well, there's really nothing to, you know, I can't just bring it in automatically, it takes a while, and if they don't have it in a warehouse, they don't have a warehouse. But, I figured since I'll make that my first coming back video of, uh, food vlogging, it's not always going to be food, um, reviews. Um, I'm thinking about starting a vlog itself, just in every few days, you know, when I have off on what I'm doing, things like that. If you guys want to see that, let me know. Again, subscribe, comment, let me know if you have a certain food and that maybe I've tried on another food review on, whatever. Advice, daily advice, I'm, I'm, I'm down for it. I will, uh, put my Instagram in the on the bio below that way you have that you know add me um let me know what you want to see i'll uh i'll see if i can add my tumblr too i'll try to do that um i don't know if anybody even uses tumblr anymore um i don't use twitter i'm barely on facebook if i don't even know if my facebook's around anymore somebody hasn't deleted it yet i was having issues with that my instagram Somebody actually went and, uh, oh, quick rant, my, um, decided to start deleting photos on my Instagram, and then they went for the bold move and deleted the entire thing. I went and called Instagram and messaged them, and I never got anything back from them. So I was like, you know what? I was like, I had photos on there from phones that are broke or, you know, sold, that I resold or whatever. Um, I can't get those photos back. Uh, photos of family members, of animals, of, of events that I can't get back because they were on that phone that I don't have anymore. Um, anyway, so be careful with your Instagrams, guys. Always change your passwords. I never thought I'd have to do that in my entire life, but I did. So, anyway, if you like this video, anyway, just type here.
And no, they didn't sponsor this. Can't come into this box. It's not sponsored. It's just me saying, you know, letting people know this is the way to go for an easy quick meal when you're on the run. Um, anyway, okay, like, comment, subscribe. If you, you know, want me to do more videos, let me know. Send me a message. Peace out, guys.